Meantime, leaders at San Diego Unified School District announced that they are cautiously planning to expand the phase two of their plan to return to in-person learning on January 4th. District leaders met earlier today and they discussed that plan. We are basing the need for that program on the advice, again, of uh, some of our key UCSD uh, partners who believe that if we can have a robust testing program in place, we can prevent upwards of 90% of the cases that would otherwise occur on campus. And that combined with the mitigation factors that we are already putting in place, the ventilation, the PPE, the cleaning of the classrooms, the uh, keeping students in small groups, we would have tremendous confidence that it will be safe for students and adults to be here on our campuses. Building that confidence of our staff and of our parents and of our students is key to what we're trying to accomplish in phase one. We've got work still to do in phase one, but we're encouraged to, you know, what we've seen so far. But we have to be able to state with confidence to our community that when we move to phase two, it will be safe for our, our students and our staff to be here on our campuses. Um, we believe that as we continue with the expansion of phase one, with the uh, safety measures that have already put in place and with a robust testing program, we will be able to move to phase two. But again, we've got to be keeping an eye on the spread of the cases in our community. So phase two has students from pre-K through fifth grade having half days for four days a week. That begins on January 4th. Then beginning on January 25th, students between the grades of 6th and 12th would return to campus for two days a week.